hey y'all welcome back today's video is gonna be about a haircut Ooh, yeah so she wanted to do a lock transformation she wanted an undercut so if you want to see what we ended up with stick around So, I have two disclaimers to put out there so you won't be caught off guard. I want you to be alarmed. Okay, number one, this is not a tutorial. This is more of a watch me work type of video. I am not a barber. I'm a cosmetologist, although haircutting falls under the cosmetology umbrella. Barbering slash haircuts, that's not my forte, okay? However, I'm trying to get there. I know the concept but I'm not proficient when it comes to doing cuts. However, certain things I can do. Although I don't have the best clippers, trimmers, what I have gets the basic work done that my clients ask for, okay? I will be retwisting her locks using the Design Essentials Curl Forming Custer. And this is a gel that is great for twists or locks or curls. It helps with elongating the curls and it helps with curl definition. However, it also has a great hold and it's done flaky. And it isn't greasy, it has a great shine to it, and it's pretty much great for locks. And I hadn't come across any issues with it yet. As I previously stated, this is not a tutorial. This is a watch me work type of video. However, if you leave questions, comments, feedback, I will try my best to get back to you with a response, okay? The reason this is not a tutorial is because I have several videos of me doing lock retwist. I have a lot of clients with locks and I know sometimes you can get kind of repetitive so there's no reason for me to you know give a step by step on what to do with retwisting locks. Also, I did not start her locks, although this is probably my third time retwisting her hair. So she wanted to do this undercut because she says she pretty much wears her hair up, I guess on like a high ponytail, and she wanted the sides and the back gone. So that's what we did today. So on her next appointment, she is really looking into having her hair colored. I also didn't do this color. 
but of course her next color I will be doing. After the retwist, I put her under the hooded dryer for about 45 minutes and now I'm just removing the clips and I'm going to use some tropical root stimulating growth oil on her hair and scalp. Right here, I'm just using the Mary's Edge Wax. Y'all know that's my favorite product to use while braiding hair. But today, I'm using it as pretty much a pomade to tame the hairs on this undercut. And then I'm just going to go through and brush the hair. And there you have it. We are finally done. She loves her hair. I wish... I could have let y'all hear that but there's music playing in the background as usual on my videos which is why you will probably never hear a video with the original audio but I'm not trying to get flagged and I don't know how to do the rights and all this type of stuff when it comes to other people's music so we're not going to use the stuff from the radio so you're not going to be able to hear how much she speaks on her love <laughs> for this haircut and her hair overall. But she was saying she loved it before I even gave her the mirror to see what the full, you know, outcome was. But thanks for watching, y'all.